To say Eric Andre has a project out for everyone right now is an understatement. With a new book diving into some of his most infamous pranks, to a one-of-a-kind stand-up show, and my favorite project, voicing John Dory, the leader of Brozone, in Trolls Band Together. Take a look. I know you. You're the guy from Brozone. We were just listening to them. Yeah, Brozone. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Don't tell me. Um, okay, well, you're not the heartthrob. Well, that's your opinion. The fun I... one? No, you're kind of uptight. Uptight? Um, not the sensitive one either. Okay, a lot of assumptions for someone you just met 30 seconds ago. Oh, oh I've got it. You're John Dory. The leader. The old one. <sighs> <laughs> and Eric joins me now. Welcome. What's it like to see you as a troll? Uh, it's pretty cool. I, I, I am a troll, so <laughs> you are what you eat, I guess. Oh, my God. Listen, the movie is adorable. Robert, my kids you. loved it. The thank music you. is so great. I heard that they took casting pretty seriously for this. So what made you Not like, really. They hired me. I well, don't know. That's what I mean. Like, what made you the <laughs> perfect John in. Dory? Uh, I, I never shut just up. Walk, you if you get me in front of a microphone and I go, <laughs> <laughs> so you're which perfect is great for it. cartoons. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Is this your first cartoon? No. Fourth? Fifth? Your fourth, fifth, okay. I did Lion King, uh, Sing 2. Oh my God. Mitchell's vs. the Machine. Oh, those are all favorites in my house. Oh, yeah, really? Too. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah. Cool, cool. Well, you have a new book out too, which yeah. chronicles like your best pranks up to date, up yes, to this day. Yes. All the pranks throughout my prank history with my writing partner, Dan Curry. Yeah, like over the years from growing up till now and, the, and, and on the Eric Andre show. What was your favorite part about going down memory lane and kind of reliving these things? I don't know if I can mention any of them on this show. This is a mom show. <laughs> oh, I don't wanna, I'll get grounded. Daytime <laughs> show. Oh, yeah, it's daytime. <laughs> we got to have a combo after dark. That's the pranks I'll tell but you I mean, about. Like the, but I, but the, the amount of time and energy that goes into these things, too, it's right? It's really stupid. It's, it's really it's really a dumb job. The amount of meetings that go into one poop joke is, is absurd. It's absurd. It's and disgusting. you talk about that in the book, like what goes into it's putting shameful. these. I'm ashamed of myself. Oh, you're ashamed of yourself. <laughs> but, I mean, you shouldn't be ashamed of yourself. You're talking about how you have to keep celebrities on your toes um, by throwing things at them that they're not prepared for. Yes. So I'm going to throw this at you. Oh, no. So our producer. Is this retaliation? I wouldn't think so. You're attacking me. You're coming because I'm down doing on this. Me. Yes. It, so listen. I feel attacked. This is actually a really I'm being positive triggered. thing. This is a positive thing. I hope thing. so. So our producer Lauren. You're very Puckwasser. violent. You're known for your I'm known for emotional my volatility. Yes, my anger. I'm going to anger management. Yeah, right after yeah. This. And plus the drinking has it's to stop. Constant. It's constant. This is all bourbon. It is. It is. It's the holidays. <laughs> um, listen, but our producer Lauren Packwasser went to high school with you. And oh, she no. <laughs> she Where's shared some of Where's these going? shared some of these photos. <laughs> first ever ever like these first seen photos of you. I was but, very into corn. I don't know if you know who that is. You were recognized so for your academic excellence your senior year. I had academic excellence. So do you feel like you have to be really smart? That's not embarrassing at all. <laughs> do you think you have to be really smart to get some of these pranks pulled off? I feel like you do have to have a level level of intelligence. Oh, well, you can't to be do, like a dumb, dumb, dumb idea. You can't be like. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you want to be the smartest person making the dumbest idea. That's where comedy lives. Yeah. But, uh, you know, what am I, Noam Chomsky? I'm not, I can't even get through a book. I didn't even read my own book. Oh, great. <laughs> I got halfway through and I was like, Instagram's on me. <laughs> You're like, where's the Cliff's Notes? Wait, so season seven, is there going to be one of the show? I can neither confirm nor deny. Okay, let's move on to the tour then. I can neither <laughs> confirm nor, nor deny. deny. Let's just pretend that that's a confirmation and we're going to put it out in the universe. Okay. okay, I like the way you think. So you're on positive tour energy. right now. Yes, yes, it's all about the positive. you got you got to balance that with the anger management. I'm um, touring Lake George. You're going to tour Lake George. This is our second Lake George reference on this show. I'll be up there every night. Uh, the Eric Andre Explosion Tour. Tell me about it. What can people expect? Why is it an explosion tour? Uh, well, I I explode all over the audience. It's um, <laughs> very, it's very. There you go. That's all the tease <laughs> anyone needs. It's the Eric Andre show live. So it's my adult swim show, the live version of it. So you can't tell me about it on TV. Yeah, well, we, we can, but you'll never have me back. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is described the as dancing like Nell, Maytay in the way. Oh Whenever she God. dances, something's about to happen. Something's about to happen. Something Just so everyone knows, about to happen. it's a mix of punk rock comedy, DIY late night entertainment. Oh, you have a blurb. And yeah, lovable a... madness Wait, on look, the road. Can I say it? Yeah. It's um, it's described as punk rock comedy, DIY I mean, late night it. entertainment. Read the read and it out. Lo and lovable madness on the road. Hopefully, I don't get hurt. 
Have I ever gotten hurt? I've gotten hurt a lot. Have you? I almost broke my rib the first show out. Oh I jumped off the stage and the, the audience parted. <laughs> and I went, boom! So and I just turned 40 and it was a very, this is 40 moment. I was like, oh! I was like the hunchback of Notre Dame the rest of the show. the rest of the tour. I didn't know I didn't cancel anything. I, <laughs> I, went, I just like walked around like Ichabod He's Grant. still alive and well, thank God. But Trolls Band Together is in theaters now. Dumb Ideas is out everywhere. Books are sold. And visit ericandretour.com if you want to see what this is in person. For more on his December 8th show in New York City, Eric, thank you so much. I love you.